Today is your day to fight back. You know, we talk about Thursday, right? If you're old school, you may have heard like, hey, throwback Thursday, and you may post a picture of throwback time when we used to be able to go to the beach and used to be able to go to restaurants and things. And regardless of what's happening right now or maybe how things are gonna change in the future, we have to take back today. We have to fight right now. We have to fight what's right in front of us. Um, and here's the hard thing that we're fighting against, not just this virus, we're fighting against the power of what we see in our day. We're fighting against the things that we hear, the things that we watch, how we occupy our time. If we allow stress to get in, if we allow anxiety, if we allow get frustration, if we allow all the negativity to come in, and why am I doing this daily dose? Because I wanna provide some encouragement. Because I can tell you, is there's been times where I wanted to give up in my life in the past, and you know what? There was a lot of battles that I fought, in fact, I'm only at 47. The funny thing is people I think in their 40s and 50s feel like that's it. Like they're done. Their time's done. The 40s, 50s. Like I've already, you know, my ba my best days are behind me. No. If you're in your 40s and 50s, regardless of what virus is going on, again, you're kind of like halfway there. So please don't give up. You got to put the fight up. And if you're just so willing to give in and just kind of let yourself go, maybe you need some encouragement. Maybe you need a song that's saying, fight my battles, right? And you know whether you have a, a strong faith-centered life or not, it's like, you need to still go to, go to war. This is essentially a war. And whether you're fighting your own battles or you have people surrounding you, a good community that are helping you fight battles, this is a battle, this is war. And whether you believe in evil that's attacking, because the way I see it is, that when things are going well, it's easy to kind of get comfortable. It's easy to not feel like we have to fight. But I can tell you in my life, although I didn't like going through some of the fights that I've had in my life, uh, relational, business, you know, uh, emotional, all those types of things, is that I look back at them now, and that's really what's shaped who I am today. It's maybe why the stress levels aren't so high. I have stress, and I'm aware of what's going on, but I'm choosing where to fight my battles.